Hey, you all. Hey, you all. Pastor Billy here. I wanted to make a quick video to suggest a couple of options for you guys when it comes to bookmarking your 100-day plan. We've gotten some feedback that it is a little bit cumbersome or just kind of annoying to have to keep re-logging in at the website, and I would like to suggest how you actually do not have to do that. So once I get to the website here, the cornerstone see me forward slash 100 days, you'll see that here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit sign up. Now that's going to take me to Journey Studio here, and I hit log in. Now, I've already kind of saved my password in here, so I'm just going to select that and sign in. And now what that's going to do is it's going to show you my plan here. So we are all the way down to Friday. Oop, looks like I haven't got to my Bible reading yet. Prayer, need to get to that. Um, but um, what I want to show you now, so once you are here, this is where you can bookmark. Um, this is where you can actually bookmark the page and save it so you don't have to keep going and signing in each time. So what you will do is if you're using Safari, you could be using Internet Explorer or Google Chrome. I use Google Chrome mostly. I would go, oh, looks like I got a notice from Pinterest there. Yes, I use Pinterest. Um, you'll go up to bookmarks and you will go add bookmark. And now if I was in your shoes, I would call it 100 days and I would hit add. Now, if you're wondering, okay, well, how do I go ahead and find that bookmark? Um, if you were to go, you know, to let's say here, um, Cornerstone. So you're back at the Cornerstone page, but you don't want to have to sign up every time. So you navigate to wherever your bookmarks are. So my bookmarks show right here. So if I click on 100 days, Now it's going to take me back right in to my 100-day plan. I didn't have to log in. I didn't have to put my password because I already saved that in my browser. And that is the best way I have found if you're the type of person that likes to close out all of your windows and keep it all nice and tidy. Um, I happen to not be that type of person. But that is the best way that I have found to make it easily accessible. And you can do the exact same thing on your phone whether you're using Safari, Internet Explorer, um, Google Chrome, whatever it might be. You can do the same thing on your phone. And then whenever you're opening a browser window on your phone or on your computer, you can just select the bookmark you want to open, and then it'll take you right there. So I hope that this was helpful to you. I also hope that, um, that this... Uh, this 100-day journey thus far has been um, has been just a great rhythm to implement in your life. I trust that the Lord is speaking to you and that your times of prayer and reflection have been very meaningful as you not only think about what he's doing in your life, but as you contend for the lives of others. And I also believe that the Lord will bring to mind somebody that you um, might get to share what it is the Lord is doing in your life. So, Thank you for being a part of this 100-day journey with us. I know that the Lord will do powerful things, not only in us individually, but corporately as a church, and we'll get to hear stories along the way. So, Lord bless you guys. If you have any feedback for us, we would love to hear from you. You can email myself. You can email info at cornerstonesemi.com, and we will get back to you as soon as we possibly can. So I hope you're heading into a wonderful weekend. May you get some rest and enjoy time with those that you care about. And we will see you on Sunday, whether that be at the 9 o'clock service or on the um, online. So bless you guys.